So let's continue with part two of making our first eye together. So I'm adding the black to the right of the eye, chain one, and I'm going straight into the next stitch with a single crochet. I'm gonna carry on that right across until we pass the light part, the light pink, okay? Um, and if you feel you need to add an extra single crochet in the same space, um, do it, okay? Just, um, yeah, it will help keep your work as flat as possible. So after we've um, made most of our portrait, we can sort of finish off with adding top stitches and things like that. So um, we can add a more detail to the features of the face. That's it obviously including the eye. Here we go, almost to the end. And we're gonna finish with a slip stitch. Now cut and finish off. Okay, so just the bottom right of the eye, or the side, gonna add the light pink. So that's a slip stitch and a single crochet in the same stitch, and then carry on, another single crochet. I'm just getting some more of my yarn. <laughs> Is it, there you go. Sometimes it can be a bit tough to stick the hook through. That was another single crochet. And in the same space there, I'm going to be doing a half double crochet. So I'm working into the side of the single crochet. Alright, so it's not actually a stitch there from the last round or anything. So that was a half double crochet. Single crochet. So that's just bring us, bringing us up now to the top of the black. So we're going to work our way around. In single crochets. And that was a slip stitch to finish. So if you add your, what color? <laughs> okay, so dark pink. <laughs> so then, yeah, sort of add it around about the same spot as where I'm doing it there. So chain one and go into the next stitch with a single crochet. So yarn over in the same space, in that same last stitch there, half double crochet. Double crochet. That's a half double crochet. And in the same space, I'm doing a single by the looks. Yep. It's really hard re watching it and then giving you audio. So, single crochet in the next. I think I'm just gesturing that we're going to go all the way down to the left of the eye with single crochet. So going forward I'll try and narrate as I make it so it'll be it'll be easier. There you go, almost there. I'm not sure whether I carried on going under actually. Let's have a look. I think I do, I think I carry on 
to go under, yeah. So we're going to carry on around, says me now. I'm probably wrong. <laughs> yeah, I was wrong. <laughs> so that's a slip stitch and cut. I haven't got the eye with me, so I can't even check. Okay. There we go. Right, so let's add some blue to the underneath of the eye. So chain one. And in the next space, well, stitch, single crochet. And I'm going to go straight into a half double crochet into the next stitch. This is going to be a double crochet. I'm, in, I'm doing two in the same stitch there, so that's another double crochet. Okay, this is going to be another double crochet. And I'm going to make it all the way across to that pink. So that's a half double crochet. And then single in the next. Yep, keep going across for your single crochets. And then slip stitch into that pink on the right. So cut and pull through. So here we go. So if you add your light pink now to the top right of the eye. So we're going to chain one and go single crochet into the next stitch. Another single crochet. So we're going to half double crochet in the next and I did another half double crochet in the same space. That's a single crochet, single crochet, single and that's a slip stitch. So you can see how we're sort of bringing up um, making some shape so we can add a brow at some point. Here we go, so add your next colour, let's find out what colour it is. <laughs> it's black, <laughs> so uh, get your black yarn ready. So we're going to add that in. So chain one, single crochet, single crochet in the next stitch and again in the next and I'm going into the same stitch there remember that's normally to keep it flat so this is a half double crochet and another half double crochet half double crochet again Half double crochet. There we go, another half double crochet. Half double crochet again in the next. Yeah, this is a double crochet. And that'll be another double crochet as well. Double crochet. That's the brow coming along nicely. So you can see now why we build up some of the stitches to the right of the eye. Just to get that nice brow shape. Okay, so now I'm going to crochet with two colours. Okay, so I'm going to continue with the black and I've added the blue. So I'm going to yarn over with the blue. It can be a bit difficult doing that with a two millimeter hook. 
So it does get a bit of pra take a bit of practice. Or you could be using a bigger hook. I mean, three millimeter normally makes it feel quite easy actually. So just double crochet in. Gonna do that all the way around to the bottom of the eye. Oops. <laughs> When you've got two um, colours that you're crocheting with, it does tend to get really tight. So you generally got to put a few extra stitches, well, two stitches in one, but do it multiple times. That's it, keep on working round. So that was a double crochet. So you don't have to follow me exactly, but yeah, this will just give you an idea. Oops, yeah, it is fiddly with the two. So now I'm gonna carry on with just the black. the yarn there. <laughs> Try again. There we go, half double crochet. You can sort of see that needs another stitch in the same space, you know. I'll have to, I'll do a separate video showing you how I, yeah, to kind of recognize when you need to put another stitch in. So single crochets, I've gone into single crochets now to go underneath the eye. Stitch. Oh, another slip stitch. So two slip stitches. And then you can cut that off. There you go. That's how it should be looking so far. So just note where I'm popping in my hook there. It doesn't have to be exactly the same, but just to give you a rough idea. So I'm adding the dark pink. So chain one and go straight into the next stitch with a single crochet. And we'll start working our way round again. That's half double crochet. Oh, well, <laughs> try again. Oh yeah, I found it a bit fiddly, but you can go through the black and the blue if you want. It's entirely up to you. There you go. So, another half. So I did two half double crochets there. And that's a double crochet. So half double crochet and double crochet that was then. And that's back to half double crochet. I did another half double crochet in the same space and then single crochet in the next. And that takes me around to the side of the eye, the right of the eye. There you go. And I'm going to, yeah, sort of finish off and pull it through the back. Almost there. For this part anyway okay so the above the brow so we're going to add the blue so with a chain one and straight into the next stitch with a single crochet and another single crochet so i'm still doing the single crochets there across the top Slip stitch, cut 
and finish off. So here we go, so we are now going to add more black. Yeah, sometimes you notice and I just I popped it in on the one stitch and then I went straight into a slip stitch into the next stitch. That I find helps so it doesn't look raised. Uh, again, I'll have to do some more videos to explain what I mean, but yeah, have a yeah. Hopefully you saw what I was doing then and you can follow along. If not pause it, go back, but well, rewind it, <laughs> go back. So just add in a bit more of the brow and some of the darker shadows. So I went into the same space there. I'm going to go all the way around the side and join up with that black at the bottom. What well, at the left there? Bottom left. <laughs> there we go. And here we are, we've almost made it. So I'm going to do a couple of, oh no, there you go. So that's our slip stitch to finish off. There you go. So now I'm looking for some white to put like a little fleck of light in the iris. But in all honesty, I am gonna redo that. <laughs> it's fine, it's just looking at the eye now, I think I did it a little bit too high. But yeah, you just sort of pull it through and do a surface stitch, just one surface stitch and then pull through and then pop that extra pop, pop that bit of string around the back and that's the eye done for the moment but I just think I pulled it through a bit too high on this on this video but it's easy to change so there you go so that's the eye finished <laughs>